Pennsylvania primary is just two weeks away from today, and voters will nominate candidates for several statewide offices, including treasurer. As KDK political editor John Delano reports, Republicans have just one candidate, while Democrats are choosing between two Western Pennsylvanians as their nominee. Four years ago, Republican Stacey Garrity defeated the incumbent state treasurer. Now two Democrats want to win back this office. Ryan Bizarro, a state representative from Erie County, and Erin McClellan, a small businesswoman from Allegheny County. Both stress their experience. I actually have run a small business and made a payroll, which I think is one of my biggest assets, having done that for almost a decade. I have extensive training in process improvement. I've actually worked on the front line of a large government agency, having worked for the Department of Human Services uh, for just under a decade there. We need a treasurer who has relationships with the legislature in order to get these programs uh, done and across the finish line. I have 10 years of relationships with both of the House and Senate Democrat and Republicans, plus the other row office uh, uh, candidates and current office holders. Uh, I'm the guy for the job, and I'm the guy that can truly modernize Treasury and use it to be an office for the people. While both Democrats have largely focused their criticisms on the Republican incumbent, they do disagree themselves says McClelland of Bizarro. So I've actually seen operationally how government works, which is a lot different than just pushing yay or nay and, and writing policy uh, as a legislator. Bizarro criticizes McClellan as someone who has run so for other offices. Issues. First and foremost, this is not a vanity project for me. Um, I don't run for multiple offices. Any office that I've run for, I've been successful at it. Um, I have the endorsement of the state party. I have the endorsement of uh, uh, folks in labor. As for this race, both Bizarro and McClellan think they can win. I think that we've been putting in the work. I think we have a real message that fits in with the ticket that really shows that we are moving forward with this office and bring real policy and real ideas to the table. And I think a woman on the ballot always plays well in a Democratic primary. So I feel really good about this one. With the help of the voters, I have every expectation of winning on April 23rd, and I'm respectfully asking all of your viewers for their vote. The Republican Stacey Garrity is unopposed in her primary. Democrats will choose their nominee on April 23rd. John Delano, KDKA TV News.